Hello, picky penguins. It is I, the lord of all cuteness, Bernie the dog. And I am here, because I have hijacked Nigga's channel. I'm looking the wrong way. Oh, there, there's something over there. I see something. Oh. Bernie says I want to get in my bed, Nico. Why are you making me do this? <laughs> oh my god. My ears are so goofy. Ah, oh, I'm so fucking tired. <laughs> I'm looking at Nico right now like, why are you making me do this, man? Ah! <laughs> She's kind of tired, so she keeps wanting to... I have a little bed over here, and she's like, let me, like, please let me go in there. It's okay, Bernie. I want to show you up for a few minutes, okay? I'll let you go in your little bed. Uh, <laughs> Bernie, you're so, you're so black, I can't, <laughs> it's hard to see your face on this thing. Oh, my God. But, yes, everyone, this is Bernie the dog in all her beautiful glory. You tell you probably say, gosh, she is yeah, she's yawning and shit down, her eyes are barely open. She's looking at me like please. Please. Uh. Yep, so I've had her for since I guess it was it was the end of March, wasn't it? Yeah. So I've had her for uh like a month and a half now. She's uh she turns fifteen weeks old next Thursday. Um, she'll be so she'll be 16 weeks old soon and when she is I'll be able to actually take her out for uh, for walks and uh, like you know walks outside and have her interact with other dogs because she needs to get I need to I, I wanted to wait till she got the rest of her uh, her shots you know make sure she didn't catch anything <laughs> oh <laughs> oh my God, Bernie, what are you doing oh I know, I know, I know. And normally, Bernie, I would let you go to your little bed. I know, I know. <laughs> I would let. <laughs> ah! Save me, picky penguins! <laughs> yeah, she's gotten, she's already gotten a lot bigger than she was before. Bernie, don't worry, buddy. I'll, I'll, I'm gonna get let you get back down there soon. I know, I know. She's not very comfortable. I, I put a towel in my lap. I hope maybe that would let her. She would want to be able. To, she'd sleep there that way. She likes to rest her her head on like. She likes to rest her head on things, so like my arm or something. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's a good girl. Yeah, who's a good girl? I am. I'm a good girl. Uh. I <laughs> oh, see. Everybody loves you, Bernie. You are the belle of the ball. You bet your biscuits. I am. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know it's, it's a little hard to see her. She is... <laughs> that's... It's it's the same way we're trying to, like, get videos or take pictures of her. Because she's so black. It's... She kind of... <laughs> I don't know. She's so dark. It's hard to see her eyes and stuff sometimes. <laughs> for, for Bernie for Bernie for president. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll vote for Bernie the dog for president. <laughs> She's really tired right now. This is usually when she's sleeping in her crate over there, and uh, she's usually sleep still morning, essentially. Yeah, she's she's a sweetheart. I'm really happy to have gotten her, and I mean, she's grown so much since I got her. When I think when I got her, she was like two pounds, like she was really tiny, and now she's like eight pounds. <laughs> I've gotten so freaking fat. Oh my god. I think all that kibble is going straight to my hips, Bert. Nico. I know. I know, Bernie. I know. I know. <laughs> oh my goodness. The picky penguins are going freaking crazy right now. They just love you that much, Bernie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Yes. Thank you so much. You guys are very sweet. She is. She is like. I feel like she's a really. Like. A, not just like, I mean, she's cute as hell, but she's, I feel like she's also like, I don't know, just like a really good looking French Bulldog in general, you know? Like, I've seen some French Bulldogs, I mean, they're still cute, but like, like their proportion size get kind of weird, like their their ears will get really, like, super big, but their head's really small, or their head gets big, and their, you know, or their body's too big, I don't know. I feel like she's really sort of, 
I don't know, just really good, like, evened out, you know? I bet I could run in a freaking dog show. I would totally win. <laughs> she's so chubby. Yeah, I know. She does have a little bit of tummy. She's not really, she's not really fat, honestly. I mean, I've, I'm very careful about, you know, you know, overfeeding her and stuff like that. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, she's, honestly, she's a good size. I, I joke about her saying, oh, she's fat, but not really. So, but yeah, she's, she's a very, she's a pretty dog. And overall, she's very sweet. She's very, very loving. She loves to sit in your lap and just, like, cuddle up with you. I mean, that's, like, it's her, <laughs> she's her favorite thing to do. Uh, Although the downside to that is she doesn't really like to be by herself, so that's probably one of the things we're sort of I'm working on a bit is that she has she has a little bit of separation anxiety, you know. Um, but on the good news, I mean, and much more so than the dog I had when I was a kid was the dog I had when I was a kid. Her name was Chelsea, and she was a she was a Springer Spaniel, very sweet dog, but uh, she was pretty. She had a lot of energy, and uh, she wasn't quite as like like cuddling and loving as Bernie what Bernie is not that Bernie can't be crazy too she has her she has her moments uh, she will uh, I don't know she'll get that devil in her and she'll she will start like just going freaking I don't know she'll like she'll play with her bed like she'll start like digging on it and like just rolling around on it and going Rawr! I just like try, I'm trying to find the right spot that's comfortable. <laughs> I think you're Bernie's mama now. Yeah, I, my family kept call has been calling me Pup Daddy. That's what they keep calling me. Keep calling like Pup Daddy. Oh, Bernie, I know, I know you want. I know, just a little longer, okay, buddy, and then you can go in your bed, okay? That's a good girl, I know. Oh my god, she's like so ready to pass out. Uh. <laughs> oh, Evie says her dog's used to tick in her bed too. They said the thing up twice. Yeah, I've heard French bulldogs can be sort can be real diggers. Um, she only does it with her bed though. I, she hasn't like gone outside and started digging in the yard, fortunately. Oh my god, she's so uh, she's so tired. You know it's way past your bedtime, isn't it, Bernie? Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I like to just set my hand up so she, uh... <laughs> she has a place to rest her head. Like... And there she's just like, Ah! Let me sleep. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, my. Your head is heavy, Bernie. So, yes, uh, I... I'm really glad I got her. I, I'm really happy that I got uh, a French Bulldog. I, uh, it is true though, a lot of things that I had read about um, are definitely true with her. Uh, she is, she can be very stubborn. Um, I, I've been teaching her like basic commands like sit and down and stay and stuff. And it's been a little bit of a struggle. She, she, you know, like I'll tell her to sit and I know she knows what it is by this point. And she'll just sort of look at me like, like I don't feel like sitting right now. <laughs> So like, please, Bernie, sit, please. <laughs> um, and also, uh, definitely have some. Uh, <laughs> it definitely have. She has some bad gas sometimes because she's a she's a flat face dog. Um, she, they tend to to swallow a lot of air a lot of times. Lots of when they're eating and drinking, uh, so they tend to have be a little gassy. And oh man, she has some smelly farts. I tell you what. Oh lordy. Some smelly, smelly, stinky farts. Let's see, what else? What else is true about the breed? Um, those are the main ones right there. Bernie of the Goober Arcana. <laughs> yeah, she is. She's she's resting her head on my my desk where my computer my de uh, keyboard is. Playing the farts of dogs. Dark fart. Yeah, I mean, all dogs pretty much fart a lot, you know? But she definitely, hers are definitely smelly. But like I said, she's, uh, and while she can be very rambunctious, overall she's a very, she is a very calm dog, I think. 
she'll she'll get I, I usually around midday like between three and five she'll get like a, a whole bunch of energy and i try to like run her run her around and try to like get it out of her i think it'll be a lot better once i can actually uh take her out for walks and stuff so yeah so pretty soon you'll you might you might see a guy with glasses walking a little black french bulldog around if you do then it's absolutely me and you should totally tackle them <laughs> Oh my god! And, this, and then I'm gonna come be walking down the street. And I'm actually gonna get tackled by one of you guys, and I'm gonna be like, "Oh shit! I sh <laughs> Why did I say that?" <laughs> gotcha, Nico. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. Anyway, uh, Frank says she's very happy to finally meet you all. She was just dying to. She said, "I'm sorry, big boy type. I'm not on my A game right now." It's been a long, hard day of just being fucking adorable. But yeah, anyway, so you guys actually might see me around. And if you do, feel free to say hello. I've never actually had anyone recognize me on public from like Nick. I've never had anyone come up to be like, are you Nico B or something? I never, I don't know. Maybe that'll never happen. But uh, I think if it d does happen, it'll probably be because I have her with me. Because I don't really show my face very often, you know, in videos. So I... I, I don't know. Some, someone might see me and think, like, is that him? I don't know. You know, like, I don't want to risk going over and be like, are you Nico B? And the guy's like, who the balls is that? How dare you talk to me? How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> but yes, anyway. So keep an eye out. If you're ever just out and about, you happen to see a tall guy with glasses and a black French bulldog, then it could very well be me. <laughs> you don't live in, if you don't live in the USA, then I, there might not be a whole lot of chance of seeing me. But <laughs> and in which case, I'd be vi if I were visiting one of those countries, uh, I'd let you guys know. So, yeah, she was a good girl. She was a good girl. So I can move the camera down to her face a little bit. Uh, oh my God, I am so fucking tired. Uh. I'm not gonna tell you which guys, what guys, what state I live in. I'm <laughs> That's just pretty much for privacy reasons. But if you do see me, if you do find me, and feel free to say hello. Hmm. Oh my god, I am so freaking goofy looking. Roberta needs to run it. Wondering what to eat tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's a she's a real sweetheart. I mean, I look forward to be able to just take her out too and letting her socialize with other dogs. And I'm pretty sure she'll be very popular. I can tell you, I live in the U.S. <laughs> That's pretty much all I'm gonna say. I, I, you know, it, it's not so much that I don't know. I mean, it's it's privacy reason privacy reasons. I don't know. I. It'd be weird if someone I managed to find out where I live or something. I, I don't know. You know, it's it's the whole internet thing. You know, like you gotta be you gotta be careful about stuff like that. Not that I don't trust you guys, but you know, there be crazy people out there, Nico. Someone might want to steal my dog, and who wouldn't? Cause she's fucking adorable. That's the one thing I'm real like like I know if I er like. I always go outside with her with her on a leash and stuff because like I never want to lose her because I know if anyone ever found this dog they would never fucking give it back. There's no way <laughs> they'd be like this dog is too adorable. It's just not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm actually in your house right now, Nate. Ah, damn it. <laughs> uh, but yes. This is her. I. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not exactly full of energy right now. It's actually one of the reasons why I wanted to do it sort of a little later tonight because I knew she would be by nine o'clock. She would totally be out. Um, I didn't want her to be too crazy for the stream. Uh, do I get her shipped? I I will. I will get her shipped. I will. I'll, I'll get her spayed. Um, when she six when she turns six months and uh, yeah, she'll get her. I can't, I, I can't wait for her, like, just to be able to take her for, out for a walk, so I feel like that really will help her midday to be a little less insane. And I think she'll, it'll be nice for her to get out and, like, see people, and I, I, God, people are just gonna be all over her. 
I live in the Council of Voices. <laughs> this is a nice closet. <laughs> so Joshua is Jesus. <laughs> I'm in your closet right now, Nico. You have a lot of polo shirts. <laughs> uh. Okay, buddy. You want to go to bed? Yes, please. Okay. All right, guys. All right. I'm going to go ahead and put her in her little bed. Hold on a second. Okay, now to put it me and myself in my usual setup here. Yeah, here's our little bed, if you guys want to see. I, I put a sheet over it, because uh, I had the fan on. I, I don't know. I, I don't want the fan to be, like, bad for her sciences or anything. And also to sort of uh, give her a bit more shade, a little darker in there. Ugh. Well, hello there. There I am. Okay, up a little bit. This way. A little bit more. Here we are. Hello. Uh, thank you all for coming tonight. Uh. Oh, <laughs> that's your bed. <laughs> that's your that's your bed. Bernie takes the big bed. Just so you guys know, uh, Bernie's a very, very deep sleeper. Um, she does not wake up like ever when I talk <laughs> so uh, if you're worried like I'm gonna be too loud or something it's it doesn't happen I I think maybe if I started yelling I she might wake up but I mean just regular talking and even slightly increased volume isn't gonna wake her up so but yes tonight we're gonna be playing downfall and uh, it, say, a little little known fact guys I'm actually a fucking star in that game yeah I, I voice like like a couple of lines. <laughs> I, I, had, I had one. I actually have a part in that game. I need to hydrate first, though. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> now I'm ready. Okay, time to turn this. <laughs> Don't yell. She doesn't trust me. She really doesn't wake up very easily. So yeah, I, I might have to stop. I mean, you know, if she needs to go outside or something, I'll probably have to stop. And I'm I'm not sure if I'll go quite as late as I usually do. Uh, you know, because again, while she won't wake up, I I, I don't want to be talking too much while she's like talking all night, and then she's like next day she's just like Ugh. try to keep her on a regularly right re fairly regular schedule. Okay. Let us get out some freaking downfall. So yes, for those of you who do not know, this uh, is a game that I actually had let's played uh, a while a while ago. Like, God, it might might be three years ago now. It's it was an old game. I played it like right after I finished the Cat Lady, and it's by the same people who made the Cat Lady. Um, it was originally it was the first game by this group, uh, Harvester Games, um, and let's see, save and run. Oops. Okay, sorry. Just want to make sure it was showing up on the screen there. <laughs> Munarakami. What on that? Because of the hair? Oh yeah. There we are. So anyway, uh, I, it's sort of awkward because this game, I, I when I tried it out earlier to, to get the 
screen all matched up. It, uh, uh, it apparently didn't have... It doesn't have a title screen, so it just, like, goes right into the game. Let's see. Might I have autofocus off on this thing? Uh, yeah, I do. Anyway, uh, I played this game, the original of this game, about, like, three years ago. Uh, and the videos are still on the channel. Um, but it was remade. Uh, the, the guy went back and redid it. And, uh... I almost, I almost like to feel like I had a, had a part in that because he, uh, I had talked to him about it. Like he'd reached out to me after I finished the original game of Downfall, and I was told him I was like, oh yeah, I thought it was great. I thought it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. It was, I mean, I could tell it was your first project, but I thought you did a good job. And I could see the Cat Lady was like a big step up. I thought he did an amazing job with that one. And he said he's like, you know, maybe one day I'll go back and remake it or something like that. And lo and behold, that's right. You're welcome, Internet. <laughs> um, but yes, uh, it, it was good. I really enjoyed it. Uh, there were definitely some quirks about it. There were some really funny bugs, too, like some inventory bugs uh, that really cra <laughs> that were really really just quite hilarious. Uh, if you haven't seen it, you should go back and watch it. But I figured since uh, this is essentially just a remake of the game, and it, for the most part, I think the story is probably going to follow about the same. Uh, I just do this as a live stream as opposed to doing another Let's Play of it. Um, for those of you who don't know, this is a uh, point-and-click uh, horror adventure game. Um, uh, it's not, like, too jump-scary, if I remember correctly. Uh, but anyway, I also was... Uh, the guy the guy who made this game, as a little added bonus, uh, decided he was going to uh, have a few... Uh, a couple of YouTubers uh, voice a few like minor roles in this game, and uh, I was I was one of the people. Me, it was me, Cry, and another YouTuber by the name of, I think of Daviosity. Um, so I'm I have a very small role in this. <laughs> I haven't actually I haven't listened to my I haven't played this this remake at all. I haven't heard my role in here. Although based on the original game, which I had heard, which, which I had played, uh, I do. I'm pretty sure I know where it's supposed to be. If it's if assuming everything goes plays out like it does in the first game or like it did originally, it I think it'll be about the like halfway into the game, like the midway point. It's a probably like a I don't know. I think maybe like a 3 to 6 hour game or something. I don't know. I I don't think I'll be able to finish it during the stream, but I might. Kind of depends how much I remember, how much has changed, things along those lines. But <laughs> yeah, so Cry will be in here. We we play dead guys. We play like we we play uh I think like skeleton dudes in the ground. We're like wise cracking dead dudes. <laughs> it was fun. It was fun. It was that was like the first time I'd ever had anyone ask me to be like a voice in a video game before. Oh, I got to change the t title card. You're right. Thank you. I always forget to do that. Let me change that real quick. Okay, we got 584 people in here. That's pretty good. Okay, downfall. Here it is. <laughs> and some of you were like, the, mo the, the movie with Hitler? No, no, no. <laughs> the war is like, nine, nine, nine. <laughs> nah, that's a, little too, that's a little too depressing. All right. Anyway, let's get started. Please select your language. Obviously, I want to... I'm going for Portuguese. <laughs> okay. I do know... I, I did notice the... Because the game starts automatically. Uh, the intro is different than it used to be. This, this prologue right here wasn't here before. Press escape to skip prologue. So what do you think, Joe? I don't know. think. Voice war, it was honest to God truth. You're full of shit. Sure he did. He's a big fat liar. <laughs> He's not. Yeah, he is. Asshole. Butthead. He heard his uncle talk about it. And he's a gangster. Gangster my ass. He works in the second hand furniture store. Whatever. Mm. 
So what's the plan? I'm gonna check out the building site. You're so dumb. <laughs> I know it's there. Come on. Find it. Yeah, right. Good luck with that. Use carrier keys to move. All right. Yeah, definitely improvement in graphics. The original was like sort of a pixely style. It wasn't bad by any stretch of the imagination. It was actually it was still it was still quite good. But uh, this is more along this matches a little more along the lines of the Cat Lady, and I loved. I don't, if any of you guys have seen my Let's Play the Cat Lady, I love that game. If you haven't if you haven't uh, if you haven't seen it or played it yourself, I really highly recommend it. Even if, you, if you don't watch the Let's Play, then just play it yourself. It was really really good. Uh. So I'm looking forward to see what he changes he made. I heard he got rid of the... They were like... I remember some of the weird things from the... Uh-oh. Ipsies! I dropped you all! <laughs> Call me Butterfinger. Sorry about that. I have you sort of precariously stacked on these, like, cardboard boxes that the, the camera came in. Which, by the way, I gotta get myself a new camera. This camera is... I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of shit. I got it with my computer, and it's it, it says it, has, it brags as 1080p quality, but I think they're fucking full of shit. <laughs> the 1080p is like all grainy and looks like ass. All right, come on, Joe. But yeah, we didn't have this in the uh, original. This flashback. <laughs> Sorry about that. Joe has a very fine strut. <laughs> Be gone, birds. Let's go get some coffee. Yeah, the artwork's... The artwork looks great. Auto-saving. Auto-save will... Turn auto-save on and off with you. Quick quick load slat, uh, last auto-save with F9. Okay. Hello there. He's up to interact, scroll options with up and down to select with enter. Okay. I'm gonna look at you. <laughs> wow, she's so pretty. <laughs> God, don't let my voice crack. Don't let my voice crack. Hi there. Ah, damn it. <laughs> hey, baby cakes. Uh, scroll options with up and down arrow. Select uh, with space. Select with enter, skip with space. Skip? Oh, like skip the... Uh, hi. Oh, skip skip through the dialogue, I gotcha. Hi. Hi. What? <laughs> nice day, huh? If you say so. <laughs> Wow, Joe, you have you have some great one-liners. What's it like to be the prettiest girl in town? If I was a cat, I I spent all nine lives with you. <laughs> oh my god, I, I I forgot what I was gonna say. Okay, uh, let's do this one because this is. If I was a cat, I'd spend all nine lives with you. Yeah. Do you really think cats have nine lives? <laughs> sure. No, that's just some silly story for kids. Uh, sure. Sure. I like cats. I'm the cat lady. When I'm older. Black. Like a devil. <laughs> now, I don't know about you guys, but that's sort of my, like, that would be my first red flag. I'd be like, black. Like Satan. I do love Satan so very much. He talks to me when I sleep. When I close my eyes, I hear him. He says, burn everything. Do it. Uh, where are you from? Do you live around here? Nice flowers. Oh, I know a place where cats go to die. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, let's let's make this conversation even weirder. Nice flowers. Yeah, but I prefer red ones. Why? No reason. I just like red. Yeah, red's great. Hey, there's the ice cream man. Back. Who? Brady. Ice cream guy. Yeah. I like ice cream. Mom says it's bad for me. 
Uh, your mom's a square. Where are you from? Sweden. But you're not blonde. Ne Sweden. So? I just never mind. What are you doing in England? I came with my mom. She got offered a job, and we stayed. And your dad? He didn't. Hmm. Sorry about your dad. Sorry about your dad. Don't be. He can fuck off. <laughs> oh, all right. Uh. Do you live around here? No. Do you? I do now. The flattest sounding little boy. Yeah, you're right. He's. He sounds like he just does not give two fucking shits. I don't want to say that to her. That's, that's fucking horrible. I, I know. Why are you sitting here? Why are you sitting here? What are you doing? Mom's inside. Eating. And she left you out here? I'm on a diet. That sucks. It's okay. I'm not hungry. Well, well now I, I have no other choice. All right. down the road a cat cemetery not quite it's just the backyard with some rubbish bins but the cats really go there to die when they're old or sick it's really weird I can show you but I should probably wait for my mom it's quiet guess you're saying I can turn it up a little bit All right. Hopefully, that's a little bit better. Uh, about that cat place. About that cat place I just said yeah. five seconds ago. Uh, sorry. Let's talk about something else. You'd be back in five minutes. Your mom will never know. There are some nice red flowers not far from there. There are some nice red flowers not far from there. But I don't even know you. Yeah. I'm Joe. Okay. And you? My name is Ivy. Ah. Come on, then, Ivy. You don't want to sit here all day. He sounds so fucking creepy. Let's do something fun. Oh, don't. Now, I Ivy, no, don't go. Don't go with him. Don't don't listen to him. I'm sorry I asked you that. Hey, you want to go someplace? So that was his uh, wife or his girlfriend and... Uh, the original game, Ivy. Oh, oh, I can move. I was like, I was like, oh, so long, long dramatic pause. Ah, okay, this, okay, other way, I guess. But first, let's get coffee. Come, follow! <laughs> Decisive strutting Joe here. Hmm, hmm. Power walk! Oh, quick slice slots one to four using F1 and F through F4. Quick load, F5 to F8. Okay. Might as well, right? Oh. There's flowers right here. She says she likes red flowers. I'm gonna smell them. I don't wanna don't I don't wanna look like a little sissy. Only little sissy dare smell flowers. Picked up. I can't even see the like flowers. Them? Wow. They're gorgeous. Here, let me pick some for you. No. Let them grow. They're beautiful as they are. Oh, I didn't hear I wasn't really hearing her accent initially, now I hear it a little bit. <laughs> Girls. You're right, it would be like killing them or something. One flower will make a fucking difference. God damn it! Take my flower, damn it! Alright, let's do this one. Let's try it. Right. It would be like killing them or something. Dude, even when he says that, it sounds fucking creepy. It would be like killing them. It would make someone else feel happy too. Gotcha. Gotcha. 
die flowers and I fucking just step on them. Crazy, crazy, strutting Joe. He does what he wants. God it is. I don't know if it's just smog or what it is. It's like orange tint everywhere. Hi, cat. But it's just one cat. And it's not even dead. I'll kill it. I guess no one, no cats died today. This one looks very old. He'll probably die soon. I bet it's a zombie cat. I bet it's a zombie cat. They turn when they're out of life. They don't. Trust me. Zombie cats are real. The giant ones are the worst. Yeah? Ah. Do they eat brains? You bet. <laughs> don't be silly. All cats are great. But you don't really like cats, do you? Actually, that, actually, the funny thing is, that's actually, I remember that, there was a, that's actually a slight callback to the cat lady, because there was a, uh, <laughs> there was a, I remember there was a choice, an option in that game, where, uh, there was like a joke, a joke option where you could, where, the cat lady is like describing a story to someone, and one of the options was like, and then a giant zombie cat came out, or something, out of nowhere, and I was just like, I'm like, what the hell? I, I want to do that one. I just want to see what she says. <laughs> and then and then she says it, and then you just see this big zombie cat sitting there with, like, blood around his face. And he's just like, <laughs> And then she's like, like, nah, just kidding. And then she gets off the real story. But slight callback, I think. Not that much. I was just fooling you. Of course I like cats. I was just fooling with you. <laughs> I, I love cats. Like cats. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go see if he likes us. Don't let it bite you. You'll turn. Ah. Aww, you're such a lovely pussycat. Mm. Hello. Hello. Huh? Come closer and stroke his head. He's gonna okay. bite. He's gonna bite me, isn't he? <laughs> but what if it is a <laughs> what if it is a zombie cat? Hey, kitty. Oh, good kid. He likes you too. I thought for sure he would fucking wow. stir. Cats never really let me touch them. It's nice, isn't it? It makes you. It makes you. Fall. Everything. What? <laughs> Don't be stupid. <laughs> Everything this kid says just sounds like it's like cat, cat, <laughs> cats. Don't usually let me touch them. You know why? Because I kill them. <laughs> I don't know. Just he sounds so fucking weird. I can't tell if if they actually had a young someone like, like someone younger read these lines, or if they just sort of like increased the pitch of uh, someone's voice. Oh, oh, the ice cream. Oh, I didn't get to say it though. So I got distracted. It's Brady, come on, let's get some ice cream. Come on. Come on, Ivy, follow me. Frolic with me. You're too fast! <laughs> you can't catch me! Hello, Ice Cream Man. Please do me a favor and do not, like, I'll give you a dollar if you happen. No! Weird fucking. I feel like this is gonna take a dark turn at any point. I'm just kinda like waiting hey, for it. Ready? Hey, little buddy. I do you for? Hey, little buddy. Two scoops of chocolate, strawberry, ice lolly, please. Raspberry ripple, coconut cone, vanilla, please. And chocolate chip. I'll go with vanilla. Vanilla, please. Vanilla? vanilla? Coming up. And what can I get for your little lady friend? I'm all right, thanks. Oh, come on. Come on. You've gotta have some. I. Don't want any. She'll have the same as me. It's free ice cream. You can't say no to that. She'll have chocolate. Girls love chocolate. <laughs> Damn it, there's no option for me to say, okay, that's fine. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Because. No. Just. No. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. Ah! 
All these options suck, Joe. You fucking asshole. Girl says she doesn't want she doesn't want the fucking ice cream, then don't give her the fucking ice cream. Don't you like ice cream? Don't you? I do. But oh, for now now I have to do it. I have to oh, great. Fucking hate you, Joe. She'll have the same as me. It's vanilla. It's... She'll have the same as me. I said no. And no means no. Oh, now she's pissed. Oh, there you go. Good for you. Go out on you, Ivy. You should probably go after her, dude. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> you decide to be an ice cream man for a living. Don't you dare give me life advice. I'm sorry. What the balls is wrong with you? You should, you should have said you don't like ice cream. <laughs> I told you I didn't want any. I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry. It's my fault. I, I freak out sometimes. It's okay. Are we good? It's okay. Are we good? We're good. Fist bump. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here's my, found it. my nerdy Healthy. friend. Yes. It's right where he said it was. But I kind of need your help. It's stuck under this thing. What are you talking about? He thinks there's a suitcase of money on the, hidden on this building. My little brother here. Don't listen to him. He's an idiot. He's my little brother. Don't listen to him. He's an idiot. I know it's there. It's drugs money. And it's just sitting there, waiting for us. Wow. Really? Wow, Every drug Monday money. they leave it there, and someone picks it up the next day. Oh yeah, I'm you sure nobody will him. miss it. Do you? Who knows? It could be true. How'd you get even get in there? This kind of stuff doesn't happen in real life. This kind of stuff doesn't happen in real life. But it's there, I can show you. There's a hole in the fence. Just follow me. I want to see. Let's do it, Joe. Uh, fuck, all right, Ivy. <laughs> just when I was thinking you were a semi-normal human being. Uh, it's not safe for you, Ivy. Just wait here. Let's just go. She's going to she's gonna force okay. her way with me anyway. Lead the way, bro. Yay! <laughs> Yay! It's a building site. Drug money! I don't want you to touch anything. I won't. And they were never heard from again. The end. <laughs> wow, that was, uh, they really cut that game down, didn't they? Yay. Everybody loves drug money. It's there. Where? This way. That's how I walk. This? Dude. See the big X? Uh, oh yeah. You said we were looking for a... You never said we were looking for pirate treasure. X marks the spot. Maybe you're right after all. This could mean anything. This could mean anything. Yeah, but we could at least check. So why didn't you open this thing yet? I tried, but... It's too heavy. And you're stronger than me. I'm sure you can do it. What is it supposed to be exactly? Hmm. Let's see. Oh, it's a concrete slab. We need to pry it open. I'll have a look around, see if I can find something. Okay. Push. Do it to push it. I'll need some kind of lever. Okay. Uh, oh. Hmm. Hey, I think I found what we need. Oh, all right. Really? Cause I don't see anything. Oh, there. <laughs> this iron bar that blends in with the ground. Uh, down to open the inventory. Scroll with the left and right arrows. Select with enter. Thanks with up. Ah, cool. Hehe. <laughs> 
<laughs> someone's gonna, yeah, I mean, we all, I think we all know, shit's about to go down at some point. Somebody's gonna be fucking dead by the end of this, I'm calling it. And I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be me or Ivy, so it's probably gonna be my little brother. And I'll be like, I'll be like, I fucking told you so, you stupid ding-dong. All right, wait. Uh, iron bar power. Oh, shit. Those grenades? Oh, yeah, we're dead. Watch this. Step away. Move. Both of you. Faster. It's grenades. A great bowl of freaking grenades. Okay. St Stop talking about the grenades. Fuck it. Oh, see? Stupid. But where's the money? There is no money. I bet there never was. I don't believe this. No. Why they hide grenades here? Don't do it. Don't this little brother's gonna be a stupid terrorists. idiot. We should call the police. Yeah, but first. <laughs> Maybe it's terrorists, let's yeah. Get out of here. No. This thing is not safe. Boom goes the little brother. This is why, are you guys ready? Are you guys fucking ready? I'm fucking calling it. Hey, dum dum. I'm gonna walk away, and you're just gonna stay here and look in there, aren't you? All right, go ahead and die. See if I get two shits. Uh, li he was liable to die eventually if it was that. If he's that's fucking stupid. Come Good on, God. Robbie. Robbie, come on, run over here in slow motion while it, the background explodes. No. What do you mean, no? I'm your older brother. You have to listen to me. He said, "Come here right now." I said, "Come here right now." I'd be a chicken like you. No way. I didn't come here for nothing. Sure, it's not the money, but this thing's got to be worth something, right? You guys ready? Don't even think about it. I'm going to sell it. Gary, from the shop, he's always looking for stuff like this. He's always looking for a box full of grenades. <laughs> what the fuck? You gave me a box full of active grenades? <laughs> I've been looking everywhere for these! Oh, boo! Uh, please don't do this to me, Robbie. Leave it alone, you dipshit! I'll never forgive you for this. I'll never forgive you. Please, don't do this to me, Robbie. Don't do it. Don't you demon do it. Nah, he's dead. Ha! <laughs> do you think we can? Do you think we can? Oh, fucking... Oh, oh, slow matrix bullet time power. Oh, the birds are frozen now. I'm drinking in slow. Oh, boom. Owned. Fucking dead. Dead, Robbie. <laughs> Joe's like, oh, ha <laughs> ha, <laughs> in your face. Oh, he's fucking dead, and absolutely nobody was surprised that happened. <laughs> and absolutely zero shits were given by Joe that day. Straight away, I knew it was her. That seemed smart. Those same emerald eyes. She didn't remember me, I think. It was probably better that way. The chemistry was instant. We fell in love and got married within a few months. Wow, alright. I never talked about Robbie. And neither did she. We were happy together. Then our luck ran out. The cracks started to show. And we both realized we're both really fucking weird but people. But I knew how to fix it. But I knew all I had to do was to be crazy. Oh, there we go. Oh, I didn't think there was a title screen. Let's do extras. Oh, that's the guy. Re uh, Rem, uh, Mi, Mi, Mikal, Mi, Mikla, Miklaski, Mikalski, Mikalski, Mikalski. That's probably it. Uh, I think, are these all like, 
Not sure what some of these are supposed to be. <laughs> the character's rare practically kills himself. He's fuck. I was like, dude, you're fucking stupid as shit. All right, you fucking deserve that. I'm not sad. Not a fucking bit. All right, let's fucking do it. Uh, start with subtitles on. Let's go. Ba ba ba. Harvester Games fucking presents. Clouds. The game. No way, that's not right. Presents. The art style is much more like the, the cat lady, which is a good thing, I think. Oh, hey, that's actually a, a, a... Oh, we actually have a little bit of 3D in here. An R. Mikalski... 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 Probably mispronouncing it. Outer Haven. Ugh. Yeah. 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 Hit me, baby. Yeah. Down ball. Ra 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 if you're not suited for playing it, well, you're probably not going to stop now, are you? Because you spent money on this game. You stupid fuck. The backgrounds look really good, actually. Oh, hello there, Mr. Face. Mr. Face. I <laughs> know the warning's a bit too late. Well, here we are. Look at those paintings. It's like they're saying, Welcome to Quiet Haven. We wouldn't want you feeling too happy now, would we? It sure looked better on the website. <laughs> Ivy? Ivy, are you alright? You're still not talking to me? Come on, darling, don't do this to me. I love you. Come on, darling. Don't do this to me. I understand you've been stressed. So have I, but but it's time to let go of that shit and try to be ourselves. So please. Isn't there a naked scene in this game? Give me this silent tree. Is there? We can start again here. Oh, actually there yeah, there but is. We will start again here. You're probably, yeah. Actually I think you're right. There's a scene I remember where someone offers to have sex with you or something. And you're I think I, I think I did both actually, and I, they were like they were both like it, it didn't really make a difference though. It was just like one where I'm just like get over here now, we just go blah, and then one where I'm just like nah maybe later, and then you know I walk out the room and then I come back and I'm like never mind. What have I done? Can we at least try to make I make a scene in front of people in this creepy motel where are there are people here? What have I done? <clears throat> we were driving. And then you went to sleep for a while, and really, she's got something in her hand the there. Hell I think. Have I done? I'd like to know. It's the only that's thing that's okay. red, only thing in color here. You know, I'm trying my best here. Like so Shinro's list, and that just cut it out and uh, talk to me. It's, it's a balloon. Been a long yeah. Drive. I'm tired, and I really don't need this. Are you still alive? I give up. I give up. Let's book us in. There's got to be someone here who can give us a room. Did you hear that? This storm is going to be huge. Storm's going to be huge. A storm is coming. <laughs> She's like, wow, really? Fuck me. All right. Give me the cold shoulder. Anyway, for anyone who hasn't watched the LP, I won't, like, I mean, assuming, of course, the game is following the same storyline. I won't spoil it for you. Like, 
but uh call for assistance. Hello? Hello? Is anybody there? I imagine it probably will be the same story. Just because they uh they also tied they actually had uh, Joe show up again in the cat lady. And <laughs> that that made a lot less sense the first time I played it because I was I hadn't played Downfall before before, so I was just like, who the fuck is this guy? And what the hell is that thing? I don't know who to call. Something usual about it. It's not unusual to be loved by you. Uh, take a gift. I'll take my free gift. They're fridge magnets advertising Quiet Haven Hotel. I'll take one. I really likes collecting them. Ivy, where are you going? She's like, now that I've got, now that you've got the magnet, I don't need you anymore. What? It reads, Teacup the Keymaster. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I actually... Because I, I, I remember something from that game. That's a... Ah, ha, ha. That's foreshadowing. Okay. I, I, like, this room is especially... I, I remember this, this one in particular. It's quite a bit like the original. Devil came through here. <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, you've got your hey, you got your voice back. Not even rats would come through in a place like this. Hey, you got your voice back. Are we okay now? Can we go back to that room? I'm just gonna ignore what you just You're said. Not alone, Joe. They are watching us. Who? These bad people. Demons. Demons. <laughs> Second red flag. Sometimes, trying to grab. They've gone now, but soon they will return. What the fucking dicks are you talking about? I knew you'd ruin it. You always, ru <laughs> you always ruin everything. I'm sorry, I gotta say that because I just want to hear. I just want to hear how. You I knew you'd ruin it. You always ruin everything. Really. I'm just trying to warn you. Warn me from what? Bad things have happened here. Bad things, Joe. Can you really not see them? No, I can't. If you close your eyes, you will see them too. They'll devour you whole, Joe. They, they will. Oh fuck. Away from him. What the dicks? I Did you get possessed there? Have gone now. I see He's dead gone. people. I don't understand. It was presented differently, that's what Gordy says. Bad flesh eating maggots with blood pouring out of their hungry mouth. They are always hungry. I can't remember exactly how they, they did it in the first bad. one. And chew the original. And swallow until we are nothing. This is crazy. We need you a doctor. You're acting like a fucking psycho. This is crazy. We need to get you to a doctor, Ivy. I, I really don't know what to do. You don't seem right, Ives. We need to leave right now. Something bad is coming. Yeah, the storm. Storm. And that's exactly why we can't leave. There are worse things than the storm, you know. Yeah, you losing your goddamn mind for once. Yeah, you losing your goddamn mind for one. Now pull yourself together and follow Pull me. your tits together, damn it. I'm sick and tired of this conversation. Can I move? Yeah. Doop -de doop -de doo I'm gonna go in here. Okay, I guess not. What are you afraid of, Ivy? What's in here? Joe Rude. I Ivy isn't doing anything wrong. She's like 
Satan's coming, Joe. Don't you see it? I want... <laughs> I'm taking this elephant with me then. <laughs> oh my god. Look how fucking massive that is. Holy perspective, Batman. I don't... I don't really know. That is really big. <laughs> that is a massive ele... Oh, hey. Holy May shit. I help you? Uh, you have a little problem. My wife is fucking bananas. Uh, You'd like to get a room? I'm just gonna pretend I that she's. See, of course. We're usually fully booked this time of year, but you're very lucky. We do have one room left. Oh, good day. Side view, recently refurbished, and sweet bathroom. It's a beauty. Don't listen to her. She's a liar. Liar, liar, liar. Fucking liar! Ah! She just punched the hole right through my chest. Blood under her nails. Excuse me. <laughs> sorry, we had a long trip. My wife's very tired. Please ignore her. Take the room. I'm sorry. We've had a long trip. <laughs> my wife's just a little on edge. Oh, all right. She, she just... I understand. I understand. I, uh, well, I do I cocaine too. I'm afraid there is one problem. What is it? Unfortunately, there's no double bed in it. Two singles. Is that okay with you? Uh. No, not really. Are there other hotels nearby? No. <laughs> in a seaside town like this. Smug bitch. I find that hard to believe. Believe what you like. I won't take much offense if you take your wife's side and call me a liar, too. But there's a storm coming, Joe. Uh. A big one. Wait, You'll what? You'll be much safer in Quiet Haven tonight. Single or double bed. At I didn't even give you my name, did I? Uh, there we go. Did you just call me Joe? How do you know my name? I heard your wife say it. I hope you don't mind. She did. Most certainly. Just before, she called me a fucking liar. Oh. It's fine, I guess. Excellent. Please follow me. I'll give you the key. <laughs> Just push the beds together, you scrubs. That's actually, you're right. That would pretty much solve it, wouldn't it? Yeah, he's, he's got the same, that same... Manly strut, didn't he? <sighs> Decisive Joe. He walks where he wants to walk. Here's the key. Now may I have your full names, please? Joe and Ivy Davis. Have you stayed here before? You look familiar. No. This is the first time. Is that all? I'd really like to get some sleep. Why, of course. First floor, room 101. Take the stairs. The lift is out of order at the moment. Seems like the. At 8 a.m. Please don't be late. Seems like the volume on Joe's voice actor is like, like quieter than everybody else's. It's like I don't know. He sort of mumbles a bit. I, I mean, I get he's probably supposed to be kind of soft-spoken and not have probably a lot of emotion, but it's a little, a little hard to hear him over the other ones. Thank God for subtitles. He's like, "Hello there. My name is Joe. Joe." Strut, strut, oh, strut. And one more thing. Yes. I'm busy strutting. What do you want? Uh, can it really? Can I wait? Really wait till tomorrow? What? What is it? There's a lady staying in room 102, right next to you. All She's right. a very light sleeper, so please try to keep your voice down. If she wakes up, she will fucking kill you. She should not be disturbed. No, she will eat you. Sure, whatever. Okay. Sure. Whatever. We'll try not to disturb anyone. Good night. We'll try not to disturb everyone. Try not to disturb... Oh! You are fucking right! Someone just said, the voice actress is really similar to that shop guy in Gemini Rue. You were... Z Zeno Fangirl. You're right! You're right, it... That actually might be the same person. Like, it's really similar. <laughs> I wasn't terribly crazy about that voice actor in that one either. <laughs> um, everybody else's voices here are alright. I, I don't know, it's just, he, he mumbles a bit. He doesn't seem to emote a lot. 
Maybe that's just maybe that's just how his voice normally sounds. Joe, can you speak up a little bit? I can't hear you when you talk like this. Come on, honey. Come on, lover dear. Let's use the lift. Ah, balls. All right, I guess I'm just gonna walk up there. Do 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 do. That's uh, fucking like God damn it! All right. No slow mode for 500. Oh, I'm proud of you guys. That's the picky penguin pride right there. Uh, wait. Which room am I in again? I thought I thought we were on. See, fourth floor. Or, oh, was the first floor. Looks like the stairs are blocked with piles of old furniture. Oh, I said 102, right? 101 or. I'm gonna go over here. It's kind of dark in here. Oh, hello. Is that a dead body on the ground? I just feel like I'm being watched. You are being watched, Joe. Doom is coming. Doom. How to walk fabulously. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna go. Hey, I'm gonna just totally not listen to later. I'm just gonna go fucking in here. Ah, oh, damn it. I wanna. I wanna disturb her. Room 101. Do not enter. Joe, Joe, there are red flags all over the place here, all right? This should be like, you know, I think we could probably find some other place. I don't know. We could probably find comfort in somewhere. I should unlock it for... No! I don't have time for unlocking. Are you... Uh, Nico already going for the hair root? Yes. As per usual. What is happening to me, Joe? <laughs> I know something's been wrong for a long time, but I used to be able to control it. And now, I don't even know who I am anymore. I don't either. You said some really weird shit. Are you just tired? Be fun playing psycho bitch in front of that woman. God damn it, Ivy! How dare you embarrass me like that? Maybe you're just tired. I'm sure tomorrow we won't even care about. I'm sure, tomorrow games. this wait, game will just wait, be wait. over. I'm losing my mind here, and you. You want me to fucking sleep? If this is reality, I can't even imagine what my dreams would be like. But thanks for your input, Joe. Useful as ever. <laughs> wow. I I love you too, honey. <laughs> Let's go to bed. I'm sure we'll feel better in the morning. I don't know what to do. One minute you're you, and the next, you're someone different. I don't even know. Who are you? What if that person has always been in me? But you... You didn't want to know. You were afraid to see her. You couldn't hide it from me all these years. Huh. Hmm. You wanna bet? The uh, so like when we saw her freak out earlier when she was like, I don't want any fucking ice cream. Satan. What do you mean? Nothing can save us. Maybe we shouldn't be together, Joe. I mean, I've been thinking. Why do you love me? There are so many reasons, Ivy. I can see who I am, Joe. We bought ice cream, I Ivy. I know your life would be easier without me. And yet you always wait for me. Can you give me just one good reason someone like me? deserves to be loved. Fine. 
Let's do this. Where do I start? I never get tired of talking to you. I love it when you go at apes. <laughs> I love it. I love it when you lose your mind and call people fucking cunts. <laughs> I love it. Wait, I love the way you <laughs> cut me down. I, you're the only person to ever compliment my manly strut. <laughs> Why? Why? Why doesn't anyone like my bad strut? Uh, I miss you even after a couple of hours. You look so cute in my Nirvana t-shirt. When you smile, I feel like the happiest man alive. I never get tired of talking to you. Uh, uh, okay, let's just do that. You smile. I feel like the happiest man alive. Oh, and this. Oh, and this. I like holding you in my arms when you're sad. A thing you do when you laugh. I love it. I can smell your perfume all in the pillow as long after you're gone. I stick my whole face in my mouth. <sighs> oh, yeah. That thing you do when you laugh. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, Jesus. We've been through so much together. I can be myself around you. You're so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can't just say you're be because you're really beautiful. You're just so fucking beautiful. <laughs> say it with gusto, Joe. I get mad spending the rest of my life with you. You're just so fucking beautiful. Up, oh, do this one. I can imagine spending the rest of my <laughs> life with you. Can it be any other way? It could never be. You like my smile. Yeah, I can't even remember the last time I smiled. Yeah, me neither, actually. I stopped laughing a long time ago. I'm There's dead inside. About any of this. Now, finally, you want to be with me forever. Yeah? I know. I've got a ring that says just that. But I don't remember where I put. Maybe I lost it. I think it's time to say it loud and clear. Ivy. I'm serious. This stupid holiday, it's never gonna fix anything. It's too late for that. So please, say it, Joe. Say it. So we can both be free. Fine, I'll say it. We're finished. But I still love you. I know you have this horrible burning... Hurtful rage towards me, but I still love you, you fucking sexy bitch. I still love you. No. See, that part was a little louder. You don't. You have to understand that, Joe. Whatever that was between us, it's gone. Ivy. I'm done talking. Go to sleep and leave me alone. What about you? I'll go to bed soon enough. After I'm done smothering you. We need to you. get up for the breakfast, don't we? 8 a.m., don't be late. I don't care about a fucking breakfast. Why? We might as well play a happy couple one last time. <laughs> Awkward. Man, Joe, you My are really killing with the ladies. Place. The only one that never changes. My escape. Ooh. My escape. From quiet haven. Like the name of the hotel. Do 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 do. Even in my dreams, I have that strut. Ew! 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 What are these bugs doing in my dream? Worms. Oh, hello there. T top floor. Ding! <laughs> uh oh, hey, whoa. It's getting inception -y in here. The buildings are. Oh. Helen Road. Oh, nice place I have here in my head. 
Do I have any mail? Do I have any brain mail? It's locked me. I could just force it open. Damn it, my fingers are too big. If only I could pry it open with some kind of dream crowbar. Dream bar. I remember this guy, Bob. We hired him when we moved to my parents' place a few years ago. It's been our home ever since. Oh. No, even if I had t time for this, they're all wilted anyway. Joe's too cool to, l to smell flowers. It's been moved recently. This looks like one of my books. What is it doing here? Oh, hello there, screwdriver. Screwdriver, set a book. How odd. How very Shawshanky. I better take it with me. Do, 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 do. I don't remember this part in the original game. I remember he had dreams, but it wasn't like... I didn't have control. It was usually just like a cutscene. I think. <laughs> Dramatic chest opening! <laughs> it's a letter. There's a 10 pound note and a key inside. Weird. Why would anyone why would anyone send send me this? Why are there so many exclamation points in that? There's a 10 pound note and a key inside. <laughs> it's like three exc is that is that what that is? It's got yeah. Ten pounds. Why would someone send me money? I'm gonna use the money. I'm gonna use the money with this door. Remember? Oh, that's oh, that's right. Now I remember, the the game had like a really like basic like you know, you you did use the wrong object with the wrong thing or something. It was like I can't use my penis with the door. <laughs> so they like I can't. I'm gonna axe the photo. I'm gonna photo the axe. I'm gonna photo the UV ray. I remember so very clearly now. It was quite enjoyable. Oh, it's locked. Fortunately, I have this key here. Hopefully they have a vending machine so I can use my brain money. There's a bicycle. Use the switch. Ah, oh, damn it. Furnace. Old Rishi Furnace. Yeah, it's broken. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go in there. A cat clock. I'm taking this thing with me. Mr. Kitty, what are you doing in this clock? <laughs> Mr. Kitty, get out of this game. Stop being a clock, Mr. Kitty. <laughs> Who's there? Yeah, fuck. Hey, who are you? Oh, you seem like... You seem like you want to be my friend. I better walk closer to you. Oh, that's your dad. Oh. Oh, ah, ah, ran right my fucking, ah. Damn it. Didn't realize I was, oh. Oh, good. All right, I was like, I died in my brain. Do I die in real life too? No, wait, I'm fine. <laughs> Slipping on the floor. Ivy? She must have already gone downstairs. It's breakfast time. Ivy! You better save me some fucking bacon, Ivy. This is all wrong. Ivy always slept on my left side. On my left side. It's all wrong. Nothing makes sense. It's very old. Single bed. No, that's that's not all right. We've been together for nearly ten years. That's a long time for two for two people to be so close. No, not now. I don't have time for that. Come on, Joe, walk faster. You should be excited for those eggs. Time to go down the stairs to death. Actually, I think it was the receptionist, if I remember correctly, who like ends up hitting on me at some point. She's like, let's fuck right now. And I'm like, okay. But first, I want to put this elephant on my head. Yeah, because I'm kicky like that. Oh, hello, dead people. Good morning, Mr. Davis. Is that an otter? Did you sleep well? Is that an otter to the right? Look at that! Is that an otter talking to... Oh, is it like a bunny? 
or yeah, I think it is a bunny. It's an otter talking to a bunny. And then there's a raccoon, and I think a possum, and the head of a fox. <laughs> wow. Uh, and the other ones are just dead. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. <laughs> wait, 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 which one do I want to say? What the, what the fuck is this? Where the fuck is my wife? Where the, the fuck is my wife? You dirty heart. Davis, such foul language. How dare you? You might be the man I thought you were, after all. Full of surprises, without a doubt. What the fuck is this? Where the fuck is my wife? Tell oh, me. She had to go. Not at first. She sat here for a bit. Wrote a note, a letter, I think. Maybe it's to you. But then she met Sophie. Who? They got on like a house on fire. They might just as well have been friends for years. They're still here somewhere. But I don't think she wants you to look for her. Joe? What the fuck is this? Who is that Sophie? Who is that Sophie? Her room is just behind your wall. 102. Oh. I told you it's not good to disturb her. Now that she's awake, she will never leave. <laughs> so, why the fuck? I like how that, that's like, that's just, ah, and then, uh, and, uh, if she's staff as mad as you, my wife's not safe with that, Sophie. Hey? No, sir. No. What the fuck is that? I don't, la, 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 la. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but stay the hell away from us. I don't know who you, who you are. But stay the hell away from us. And I thought we were friends, Joe. I don't know you. I can help it. Take a sit. Eat with us. You'll feel all these worries fade away in I'm not eating with that dirty otter over there. He's giving me a look. That otter is a racist. I don't care about breathless. Nah, no thanks. Uh, nah, I'm, I'm, uh, I, I had a full, uh, no a full... Thing. Pre breakfast. What a bad way to start the day, Mr. Davis. They say it's the most important meal of the day. This is madness. I've got to go. No, I'll this is downfall. I was afraid you'd say that. But fine. I won't stand in your way. As a matter of fact, I'll help you. I've left a key to Sophie's room on reception desk. Maybe it's not too late. I changed cha my mind. I want to talk to the otter after all. <laughs> option two, be an ass and leave. That's There's always that option. Always. But first, I'm, I'm going to go make myself a sandwich. Nobody better stop me. Ah, fuck my balls. Fuck this place. I hate all of you. Oh, that fucking cat. I knew I'd run into you. I know I know a puzzle where I'm... Wait, what happened? Did I pick the wrong one? I want to go in this one then. What the crack coffee's happening in here? What do you want from me? Mr. Kid. Here, Mr. Kitty. Now, he had the cat. Uh, uh, people said, "What do you?" He had the cat. Uh, the the key to the room. Oh, that's a lovely pair of boobs right there. That lady has lovely pair of tie dye boobs. Oh, you're gonna go open the door for me, Mr. Kitty? You're just gonna poop it out your butt? What in the dicks? Which way now? Let's go this way. Sophie appeared in a lot of different ways. Oh, oh, I can still move. Uh oh, I was, I thought it was loading. 
Uh. Wait, what happened? Did I pick the wrong one? I'm gonna go in this one then. What the crack coffee's happening in here? What do you want from me? Mr. Kitty. Mr. Kitty. What room do I go in? When I open it, it causes like the lights go out. I have to go downstairs, maybe? I didn't even get up here. Oh, hey, look, there's a picture of an elephant. Uh, it's the elephant that's dead. He's come for payback. Mr. Fucking Mr. Kitty. Oh, what? We had a black cat once. I told Ivy I buried him in the park. She'll never know. It's a teacup, teacup the key master, get it? Ah ha ha ha. Uh. uh. It looks like I have to go that way. One of those must be the right door. Try this one then. Okay. It's like two doors I haven't tried yet. I think. This one, I think, and this one? Not sure. Try the second door. Oh, there we are. Not really sure what let how I was supposed to know that one. Just other than trial and error. Ooh, what's on TV today? Oh, this is my favorite show. This is the part where we all die. <laughs> Oh, hey, it's me on TV. Doom is coming. Picky penguins. Doom. Doop de doop. Joe, look, look, look how little Joe gives a shit, too. He's just like, ah. Oh. Yeah, look, I'm on TV now. Cool. Oh, it's Winnie in this TV. The Midnight Channel. You're right. Mr. Kitty! Mr. Kitty, how'd you get me in the TV? Ah. Fucking asshole, Mr. Kitty. Uh. Hi, Mr. Carr. Uh. Enter. Must get away from wind. Oh, now I'm back here again. What do you fucking know? I can't examine the mailboxes for some reason. I see a brick wall. This door better be unlocked because I don't have the key anymore. I don't have my dream key. Okay. There you are. Oh, you're going down, Mr. Kitty. I'm going to throw you in the incinerator. This is the end of the road, you sneaky son of a bitch. Yes. Time to kill Mr. Kitty. You're going to die today, Mr. Kitty. You're going to die. 
Nobody's gonna miss you. Oh, fuck me, Mr. Kitty. Running away, my one weakness. Joe, not fast enough to get cat. Oh, you are something else, aren't you? Uh, let's see. Wait. I know what I need to do. I must. Wait. No. Let's, uh... I'm gonna use the cat clock. I don't know why. Oh. For some reason... That actually worked. Oh, he's always oh, gonna see the clock, the the clock, and be like, "Oh, that's a friendly kitty." I should hop in there. Yep. Oh, bird. Oh, hi there. Sorry, I'm not gonna dump. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna let my uh, cat microwave for a little bit. Are you still there? Yeah, you are. <laughs> I like how it's like walk up to him. Uh. Hoo wee! I like microwaving a good old Mr. Kitty. Burn! Fuck that! Fuck you, Mr. Kitty! Who had the last laugh? That's right, me. Ow, it's hot. Ah, ah, ah. Uh. Oh, wait, what is it? I see Char remains of the cat. I, I didn't mean to do this. First, it was supposed to be broken. Yeah, I totally did. This is actually, this is actually very different from how I did in, in the original game. The original game, I think I got, like, a knife. I, I don't know if the cat was alive. I thought the cat, I think the cat was already dead. I think. And then I had to use a knife to cut, him, cut it open and get the key that way. Barbecue time! It's hot. What do I... So I have anything? I'll use... Oh! I have a cat magnet. Of course. Use magnet to get Let's key. This. I've got it. Yeah! That's a... That must be a strong magnet. Uh huh? Uh huh? Oh. That's not a good sign. Oh, that appears to be a dead end over there. Better keep walking. Oh, hey! What? How did I... How the dicks did I get back here? Welcome back, Joe. Welcome back. Thanks, Mr. Kitty. <laughs> Fuck you, man. Let's go say hello to our new friend. Sophie. Are you there, Sophie? Oh, hello there. I like your mirrors. <laughs> Welcome. Look at... I should bring a mask. Who are you? You know damn well who I am, Joe. Is your name Sophie? <laughs> See? It wasn't that hard now, was it? <laughs> uh there's something wrong going on there's something wrong going on here, and you will tell you're gonna tell me what it is. What is this place? Well the mirrors, where's my wife? What is this place? Why all the mirrors? <laughs> This is the madness, Joe. Oh, of course. Let's try to enjoy it while we can. Try. I'm not mad. You are. It's this place that's mad. Where's my wife? You didn't answer my question. Where are we? Where's my wife? Where's my wife? Where's my... She's still around here somewhere. But hidden away so you couldn't find her. But... Why? Why would she have to hide from me? She found a monster inside her, 
and no one can ever see. Even you. That's not happening. Joe get what Joe want. Did you say a monster? Did you say a monster? Don't tell me you didn't see it. It's been lurking around for quite a while. There are no monsters. There are don't always monsters. I don't know what you're talking about. But you know this monster, Joe. It's the kind that lives in your mirror. And He's right here. Bad things <sighs> alone. Rip my face off. And if you start listening, it grows stronger. Then, then there is no going back. You fall and keep falling until there is nothing. Do you want to see? Just look into one of these broken mirrors here. Go on, see it for yourself. No, I've seen enough. Okay, I'll do it. Cause I'm Joe. Okay, I'll do it. Cause I'm Joe Swanson. Wait now. Any. Okay. Look into this. And I will see. I'm gonna bet that's not cocoa butter dripping from the ceiling. Wait, actually it is cocoa butter. Oh, oh, what a beautiful, wonderful place this is. Oh my God. Ah, 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 ah. Ew. Uh. Ah, oh. oh yeah. Fucking rip my heart out, damn it. Saw it for yourself. Damn that chick was hot. A pretty, pretty girl. <laughs> it doesn't really matter if you believe in monsters, Joe. It won't make them go away, you know. Sometimes there's just nothing you can do. But sometimes, if you're willing to sacrifice everything, you can achieve the impossible. I'll do anything, save Ivy. You're wasting my motherfucking time. I'll do anything. I'll do anything, anything save Ivy. Good. Then I'll tell you what to do. Okay. It's very simple, really. You just have to kill me. What? Why? I want to die, Joe. It's no big deal. I'm just a memory anyway. We kill memories all the time. Can't just kill you. I can't. I can do this. I can do this without your help. <laughs> I was gonna do that anyway. Uh, what do you mean by your memory? What do you mean you're a memory? That's exactly what I am. A memory of Sophie. There are four of us here. The others are mostly raving lunatics. But not me. If you kill us all, you will open her hiding place. Ah, uh, yeah. A world inside a mirror. The only one that's still not broken. But how do I know if you're telling the truth? Look around you. You're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> I'd already told you. This is the madness, Joe. Madness. Madness! No! This is my room of mirrors. I can't just kill you. Uh, how should I kill you? This is, this is madness. How do you want me to do it? How? How should I kill you? Poison me. What? Just give me something. I want to go to sleep and never wake up again. It won't hurt that way. I... 
I don't. I'll do it I don't myself, know about that. Joe. I think that old fool Dr. Z had a stash of poison down in the basement. All I need is for you to find it and bring it here. This is a terrible idea. <laughs> this no is a terrible idea. I am that one good memory of Sophie, you know? Just before things went to shit. And that's why I have to die first. Uh. I can't just kill you. Who do you think I am? Ah, <laughs> 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 yes! <laughs> but you killed the cat, didn't you? How do you know about Mr. Kitty? <laughs> no witnesses! Duh! I didn't kill the cat, it was that creep with an axe. So messed up. I didn't kill the cat. It was that creep with an axe. Ah, the sweet denial. You don't understand what happened. I... I didn't mean to burn it. But what else could you have done to get that key? Basically pooped Wait it out? that poor animal to shit it out. Yeah. No. We both know the truth, Joe. You are not a patient man. You knew from the start that this I don't have time for poops. Now be a man and admit it. And then kill me. Uh I swear I, I can't keep fighting her about I this. I swear. I, I didn't, didn't do it, okay? On purpose. An accident. Interesting. But never mind. What happened happened, Joe. Why should you explain yourself to me? Why? Uh. This is so messed up. It's very simple. Kill four memories. But me first. Okay, I'll come back later to kill you. Bye bye. No. Think about it. Oh, I know you will. I'm gonna look at her. Why is she wearing that mask? Tell me. Well, that was an interesting conversation I had. I must say, <laughs> the sleeping establishment here is rather unremarkable. Wait, is this thing on the ground right there? There, oh, there is. Hello. I miss you. You know. Oh. We work good together. Always there. When I was falling. And bad felt better. Every time. With you. Thanks. Hmm. I can't remember. I, I, Sophie was in this, and I do remember that. And I think it was the same thing. You had to kill four people, four different versions of Sophie. Oh. Phone's ringing. Wait, is it? Was it in here? No. I can't really remember who Sophie was supposed to be. If it was supposed to be Ivy, I don't remember. I'm coming, I'm coming, damn it. Hold your horses. Okay. Whoa, our dinner guests are waiting. Yeah, oh, fuck me. 
Well, what the? Uh. Uh. Ground floor. First floor. Second floor. Hey, Fancy baby. meeting you here, Joe. You work I here. I thought you'd be long <laughs> by now. Oh, it must be that weather. Nasty. Then again, it always rains here. Always. It lost no time for small talk. Not going anywhere until I save my goddamn wife. Oh, this is real, and neither are you. None of this is real. And neither are you. Oh, but it is, Joe. I'll prove it to you. No thanks. But I'm giving you my permission. Don't be so scared. Come closer and see how very real I am. You can touch me. I know you want to. Oh, here we go. Now you're talking. Are you coming on to me? Look, this really isn't a good time. Go touch yourself, crazy lady. <laughs> go touch yourself, crazy lady. Oh, wicked burn. Oh, I will. And you can look, Joe. Will that be okay with your precious ivy? I'll ask her when I find her. <laughs> Still searching for her, are we? Well, go on then. I'll wait. Just let me know when you've had enough. I'll be in my office. Touching myself. Wow, this place is kinky. Crazy ass hotel people. What in the world is that? Oh, hello, Mr. Face. Well, hello there, Nico. It's a fine day to die, isn't it? Eh, I seem better. I've seen better days. I've seen better days. Oh, yeah. Let's go down this dark corridor. That's the smartest thing to do right now. Or any of these rooms of fuck. God damn it. How dare they lock their rooms like they don't want me to go in there. I'm gonna push this cigarette machine. <laughs> Ah! I need some motherfucking cigarettes. Get in here. Let's try again. Nothing. Let's try again. Third time's the charm. Nothing. Oh, come on. Nothing. Damn it. All right, what about use. There are ten pa There are ten pounds of pack. I should put the money in. Oh, oh, here we go. My dream money count has finally come in handy. It's your moment now, Dream Money. Thank you. No, no, no. The pack got stuck. Ah, fuck. Come out, you damn thing. Come out. Oh, my cigarettes. I'm not a patient man. Nothing. If only I had another tenor. Oh. Damn it. I need more money. Fuck. I gotta go burn me another cat. Why did you do that, Mr. Painting? What are you trying to tell me? <laughs> nothing. Wait, nothing. Wait, no, nothing. They better not be saying at the end of this hallway. Going in a big circle here. Oh, hey, this room is open. I don't believe it. Hello. Well, I'll take this glass bowl with me. Oh, it's beautiful ornamental bowls. They'll look great in my house. T tempting. Pull it. Not sure what it does. I'll feel better to leave it alone for now. No, but I want to. I better sit in this chair. Is this an electric chair? Or some cables running from the chair further into the room. Isn't the old Sparky? That's a terrible idea. When they don't give me the fucking eye. Oh. Oh, yeah. I remember you, dude. Crazy doctor guy. Hi. What's that? I'm busy. 
Just get on with it and be quick. But what's going on here? Oh, I'll tell you what is going on. Going bad, on. bad things are going on, and I'm not impressed. What bad things? Don't tell me you didn't notice. Death is everywhere. The whispering from the walls. Those shadows in the corner of my eye, they move when I look at them, but they're there all right. Watching. You're crazy. No. You're no, crazy. No, no. It's this place that is crazy. I'm only trying to fix it. Who are you? Why? Have we not been acquainted yet? You spelled acquainted wrong. For that, you must die! Dressed as a doctor. Performing brain surgery. He's still alive. Alive brain surgery. Jesus, man. What the? Now this, this here, is called a Lazarus sign. Worry you not, it often occurs post-mortem. But I assure you, this lady has been well and truly dead for quite some time now. I think you're kind of, I think you're pulling my chain is what you are doing. Just leave her alone. So, it's an autopsy? Not exactly. I'm still trying to save her. You said she's dead. It's too late. It is never too late. You know, the original game wasn't voice acted, so I, I think this, this, this guy actually might have been the first person I ever gave the German voice to. I think. Grab my wife. Who is she? Who is she anyway? What? Who? What do you mean, who? The girl on the table with her head cut open. Oh, her, yes. Oh, yes, ah. Oh. I'm not quite sure, but my assumption is she is of great significance in all of this. I think her name is Agnes. So you knew her when she was alive? Oh, no, not really. It was embroidered in her knickers. I'm trying to find my wife. Well, you won't find her here, that is certain. Most visitors I get are stiff as a board. But don't get me wrong, that's fine with me. This way I really I like get to see like the that. sick filth that fills their troubled little heads. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you, really? Isn't it quite clear enough? Oh no, that's not my... Doctor. That's not... If I can't save us all from this downfall, then no one can. Oh, he said he said the name of the game. No, I, I don't mean the... Uh, I don't mean this guy hears like my voice or something. That's this isn't the part I acted. Um, I uh, I'll let you guys know when that that comes up. But uh, it's when I was when I LP the uh, original game. I I voiced the characters, you know, like I do in uh, most of my LPs when there's no voice for, when there's no voice acting. And I gave this guy uh, when I found him in the game the the German voice. And I think it might be the first time I gave a, a character that voice. Can you save me? Can't save everyone. You're full of shit. Can you save me? Yes. Yes. But Go. I need your help. Don't worry, it's nothing complicated. All I need you to do is this. His eyes look Bring like they're going like kind of derpy. Like from it. the cellar. I'll give you the key. Bring what? You'll know when you see it. I'm sure you will. Can you go and fetch it for me? Fine. I'll go to the cellar. Good. Go. Ooh. Quickly. Here's the key. I'll get everything ready. But things are definitely moving very differently than they did in the original. This guy was in there, but I, I don't think I ran into him until much later. And I remember, actually, there was the puzzle for him was to find, like, man I had to find mannequin parts to put on the mannequin that, that was in the same room as him. Okay. Can you hear that? It's the ticking of the clock. And it's getting louder! Okay. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. Agnes was was it the girl you ended up hanging out with? I don't. Okay, now I'm gonna send this thing. Ah, oh, damn it. I thought Agnes was the the girl in this game that you end up uh, going, walking around with. That's not right. I don't know. 
The cellar. Where's the cellar again? You got a third floor. girl in the wedding dress that followed you. Seems the creator killed her. Oh! Okay. That's what I thought. Oh. I don't want to see her this game. Ah, oh, bummer. Unless she turns into a zombie or something. Oh, this is... I remember this room. The room with the... with all the plants and stuff. Oh! I do remember... I think I remember... Will there be... Will, is there gonna be, like, some random, uh... English guy over here? He's like, Oh, I just beautiful day it is today and then there's like some lady like <laughs> with her with him the whole time let's see top of the morning to you it is beautiful oh hello oh that's right there are also a bunch of fucking dead people but bunch of real dead large women she slashed her wrists in a bathtub when asked to win it die Day. Oh, shotgun. There's, these stiff dead fingers will never loosen their grip on the gun. Better use a syringe. I can't I can't use syringe on shotgun. Turn knobs. Nothing happens. The gas supply has probably been turned off. Blah blah blah. Oh, ah, yep, there's another Sophie that's still alive, that's right. Alright. This one's the, this one's the same the game. Yeah. Yeah. Me. Where's my wife? Tell me. You will never find her. She is mine. Mine. You disgust me. I'm not scared of you. Oh, we'll see about that. We'll see about that. <laughs> Strangle her. No, she must die. Hey, we should get a cat. And we'll cuddle it tight every time we feel sad. Oh. No. I, I think for this one, actually, I use a shot. I think I used the shotgun on her. I think I shoot her in the fucking face. Go. I'm like, die, bitch, boom. No, she can't die this way. She's got to die some other way. Look closer. Closer. Painting of a lady wearing a hat. She, she's got an ass smile on her face. feel like... I, I, her eyes have been following me around around the room. Are they? Private party tonight. Invitations only. It's dark inside. I guess the party hasn't started yet. Damn it! I think that I think that I think that random British guy's gonna be in there. He's gonna be there. I think the syringe might be used to to poison. Uh, 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 the first Sophie. Let's go to the fourth law. No, Nico, she explodes. I thought I shot her with a shotgun. Ah, fuck my dick! Ah, oh, back to the ground floor. Ground floor. Ding! Ah, fuck me, Mr. Kitty. You totally did that, didn't you? Even in death, Mr. Kitty, you hostile haunt me. Okay, I don't know where the cellar's supposed to be. This is the kitchen. Still locked. Uh... Not here. It looks like I couldn't go to the fourth floor, so... Where's this take me on the... If I go to the first floor... I don't remember seeing where the elevator was. Hit! <laughs> Joe just shakes that off like everything else. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Oh, devil came through here. This was this thing I think I remember the most from that game, and it was kind of a sort of, sort of iconic. I felt like the devil came through here. I don't really know what that means, but I remember it. And I believe this is yeah, this is the mirror I'm trying to break. Yeah, I, once I kill the Sophies, this mirror is gonna start breaking, and I remember it breaks into the shape of a person. I should did in that game. Oh, oh, go to the stairs. All right. Over this way. Down these stairs. Ah, yes, here we are. Uh, doop, doop, doop. Doop, doop. Doop, doop. There we are. Hello, is there anyone down here? Do you I see have no idea what I'm looking for. You'll know it when you see it, he says. Yeah, right. Is that a dude right there? Pretty sure I see a guy sitting there. I'm gonna take this battle with me. Oh yeah. It's a trap door here. Chef's jacket. Stained chef's uniform. Surely sent down here for cleaning. Oh, whoops. It's of no use to me, but there's something in the pockets? There's a key inside. Oh, thank you. Oh, there's the kitchen key. Castor oil. A bottle of castor oil. Never meant, never to be consumed with blueberry pies. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like that perspective. Oh! Oh, yeah. Th I, this was this was in the original, too. I have to... I have to get something out of this dead dude. Uh, Whoa. Whoa, dead guy. R I'm gonna remove his skin flaps. Oh, yeah. Where'd your brain go, dude? What in the... Whoa. Oh, you have a bathroom in your brain. Of course you do. Thanks for doing the dishes, Ives. Thanks for making dinner. It was nice. I'm just... I'm just glad you're eating again. It got me a little worried. You know, this whole... Can we just forget about it? I'm fine. There is nothing to worry about. Nothing. Oh, I control her now. There's nothing to worry about. Huh? Oh. Joe's coming to say hello, dear. Ah, oh, fuck me. Death is coming, Piggy Penguins. <gasps> Fuck. Mr. Kitty! You stupid cats. Fuck you, Mr. Kitty. Stop coming back from the dead, Mr. Kitty. Oh. Oh, damn it! There's an obese woman in my mirror. Oh, fuck me. Oh my god. Hello there. La, la, la. Well, hello there, neighbor.
pathetic. Pathetic. Ugly. Bitch. Everyone's looking at you. Your fat, disgusting body on their tongues. Let me out! Please, just let me out! There is only one way out. And you know it. Because you've been there many times before. No, I don't want to. Quiet. Quiet. Now, be a good fat little girl and crawl into that hole before anyone sees you. Alright, crawl into the toilet. It's the only way. Oh, wait, there was a brain in there the whole time. I just didn't see it. I just imagined a bathroom. I Give can't me. just carry it upstairs in my hands. Oh, come on, man. Don't There's be got to be some way I can deliver it fresh. It's got, got, got to keep it fresh. Hmm. A fresh brain for me. Oh, good. For me, the I switched it on. The birth of your German voice, or whatever the fuck, whatever the fuck accent this is supposed to be. I've switched it off now. Or switch it on. I've switched it on. Ah, uh, yes, yes, that's the. That's right. It's the gas. It's the burner for upstairs where the uh, the the pulsing saying chick is. All right, there's some shells here. All these bottles, are they poison? My God. My God. You just have to kill me. We kill memories all the time. Okay, I can do this. But I've only got one shot. Which one do I take? Ah, damn it. I had that. This is. I, I remember this. And so. And I, I remember the first time I did this, I did the bad one. It's basically, you have two poisons. One will kill her uh, painlessly, and one will kill her very painfully, causing her fucking head to explode. She goes, she's like, oh my god, my head feels like. Ah, boo! And then, it's like, I feel kind of funny. And boo! I'm just like, ah, oh, ah! Oh. I don't remember which one it was, though. Red makes me think of blood, danger, and fire. Blue color of the sky, water, and no, her eyes were never blue. They were green. I don't know if this is a trick, though. I don't know. Better save. I don't know if this is like playing a trick on you, though, make you think that. You know? Like reverse psychology. Use the. It's like, oh, it's gonna pick the blue one, but maybe they knew I was gonna not pick that one. And then, so then I know that by not picking my not pick one, I go pop, pop, beep, 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 beep. <laughs> oh my God, everyone's so split. Take the red pill, take the blue pill. So wait, I'm sorry, which one keeps me in the matrix again? Uh, uh, and then I'll wake up and I'll have Morpheus, pa no, that's not right. I don't remember that, what is it? Red. Oh, purple. Mix them together. Seen after a single injection. Damn it. All right, wait. Can I make purple? Uh. All right, I got the syringe here. I'm sure one of these would give somebody a peaceful death. But which one? Take the purple one. I don't know. Free, free will is a lie. Uh, you're telling me I've already made this decision in the future. Oh my god. Uh, which, which poison will Nico pick? Will he give it the right one? Will Sophie's head explode like it did in the first game? Find out next time on Downfall Z. Fred. It's time for your 
medicine girl. It's time for your medicine. Wow. Alright, let's go. Uh, oh yeah, oh, uh, 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 oh, here we go. Gonna drop the beats out. Okay, uh, up the stairs. Let's see. I, 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 all I remember is that I got wrong the first time in the last game. When I, in the last time I played the, first, the original. Let's see if I did it again. <laughs> Let's see if I made the exact same mistake I did last time. All right. All right, honey. Here's your medicine. This syringe? Is this what you wanted? It seems so. But... Will it hurt? No, you won't feel a thing. I really know. I hope not. <laughs> What's the matter? You'll be fucking dead. I don't really know. I hope not. You don't know? Are you sure it's... Are you even sure it's gonna kill me? I was poised around the bottle on a picture of a skull. There's only one way to find out. If there was poison written on the bottle. Every a skull has there. Picture of a skull. Okay. That sounds about right, I guess. But I'm going to ask you one last favor. What? Can you do it? What? Take that needle and stick it in my arm. Lady! I don't. I can't do it myself. No. Please. I'm begging you. Give injection. Fine. Die. Okay. I'm already doomed anyway. Die, bitch. Give me your arm. I'm gonna do it right in her face. Bah! Alright. <laughs> Alright, how you feel? Ah, damn it, I did it again! Boom! Oh! Fucking splattered. Oops. <laughs> Every fucking time. Damn it. <laughs> uh oh. I done did it again. <laughs> I did the same fucking thing I did last game. Ah, fuck me. All over my mirrors. Let's try that again. <laughs> Ah, god damn it! All right, so it was the obvious one after all. You fucking, you fucking liars! I hate you. I'm sure one of these would give somebody a peaceful death. Stupid. Which one? Fucking bottles. So it really was just the blue one. Here goes nothing. <sighs> it's time for your medicine, girl. Time for your for real this time. Watch this make her fucking explode too. I'm just, you know what? <laughs> Although last time she actually said, she goes, I don't know, I feel kind of funny. My head feels like it's gonna explode! And she goes, boo! Ah! <laughs> uh, god dang it. What kind of poison was that? Oh my god. That was some fucking hardcore shit. Oh, these beats. Mmm. Yeah, okay. All right, honey. I, I'm sorry. I'm really I'm, my bad. All right, but you know, I mean, right? Come on. And like it, it, they literally spelled out for me there, but I did the wrong thing anyway because I thought it would just be. I mean, who who would do that, huh? Who would make it that easy for me? Apparently, this game. All right, take my poison. The syringe. It seems so. It seems so. Would it kill me? No, you won't feel a thing. Good. Okay, blah 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 blah. Skipping, I think. All right, oh, take. Fuck it. Yeah, oh, fuck it. Give me your. Die peacefully this time. <laughs> then her whole body just explodes.
Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> there is no right answer. The answer is purple. Ah, god damn it. Ah. Ah, no. What the fuck? Ah, oh, no. Ah. Ah. Blah, blah, blah. God damn it. Well, maybe that was a painless death, you know? I don't know. I shouldn't feel anything when her fucking brain exploded. Everyone keeps saying it's purple. Let's try. This is the last time. I swear, I swear to God, if it fucks with me again, I'm going to rip my face off. All right, I'm going to take I'm going to take both. All right, even though no, I don't know how that would make any fucking sense. You think it would just be double the death, right? It's time for your medicine. It's time for your medicine, girl. No, it isn't, actually. Can I... Oh, fuck you. Really? Oh. Fine. All right. She's just going to get her head fucking blown up. I can't do anything. It won't let me... I don't... What am I supposed to do? I thought I could, like, mix them together. Does anybody have a... You got trolled. Yeah, and the other game, it didn't do that. It actually, it, one of them really did give you a uh, peaceful death. The other one was was painful. Yeah, double poison means le means less painful. Okay, all right. I thought maybe if I picks if I actually mix them together. <laughs> it's inevitable. All right, fine. A refuser? All right, well, might as well, right? I don't think it's gonna do anything. I think I'm gonna have to do it. Ba 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 ba. No, it's gonna fucking hurt. I'm I'm, I'm not gonna. Matter. You'll be fucking dead. You heartless son of a. But really, that's okay. I get it. You will never understand others. You never did. Will you at least help me do it? What? Blah, 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 blah. All right, no. let's try. I don't want your blood on my hands. But, Joe, you are already covered in it. From head to toes. I said no. Fine. I'll do it myself. Perhaps I should. Good luck, Joe Davis. For oh. what it's worth. I hope you find your ivy. That was different from before. Before... Okay, your head's probably still gonna explode, though. Just want to let you know that. Do it for me! Yeah! Make it rain, bitch! Oh, yeah! Oh, let the giblets fly! Mmm, oh, oh, yummy giblets. Mm. Uh, I don't know about you guys. This game's making me hungry. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna take this dress with me. You don't need it anymore. <laughs> I'm gonna put this dress on. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> nope. It is almost clean. Well, at least I didn't. Technically, I didn't kill you. Technically, that was your fault. You asked for it. Time to time leap again. <laughs> oh well, whatever. Let's go to the kitchen. I'm gonna make myself a sandwich. I'm hungry after that. Bernie says, "I want, I want some of that too." Yeah. I know. I see you. She's snoring. <laughs> it's like, all right, all right. Uh, oh. 
Is it a wedding dress? Is Acme still alive? I don't think she is, but. Do, do, do. Wait, wait. Uh, there we are. I think there's actually a cooler in here, and then I use the cooler to get the brain or something. Oh! There's the. Oh my god, do you guys remember? Do you guys remember the blender from the original game? Oh! I hope, I hope we we're gonna still do the same fucking thing. Make a fucking deadly smoothie. It was beautiful. Oh, and every time I used the blender, like this kick ass rock song would go on. I was like, da, 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 I hope he, I hope he does that. I literally stick a Cuban head in a blender. It was amazing. This is, oh, I can't take it with me. That's one big blender. That's one big blender. I'm gonna fucking get some heads on. So I think the pot. I'll just, I'll just burn it. Oh, I'm gonna cook me up some good. Oh, hello, Mr. Pig. Give me your ice pick. Oh, he oh, hello. And you're a 3D pig. I'm gonna talk to you. I know you're just a pig. But I want to tell you this. <laughs> I want to tell you this. I love you. It, it's all your fault, Mr. P <laughs> what? Can we swap places? Sup? Fuck you! No, fuck you, pig! Sorry, dude. I screwed up, man. I know. It was supposed to be you. It was supposed to be me. Ah, forget it. I screwed up, man. I screwed up. I did. I did. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mr. Pig. Or is it just sleeping? Only one way to find out about stabbing with this. Not here. What? Not here. Over there first. Take some ice. I can't break it with my hands. Yes, I do. Uh. Oh. That's what the ice pick's for, of course. Some kind of vessel. I can't just carry around my hands. Of course I do. Of course I can. Oh, of course. And that's what the bull's for. This is all actually the same. I remember doing this. It's like all coming back to me. I filled it with ice. Hey, would you like some ice, Mr. Pig? Talk to me, pig. No. I'm going to use... Wait. How about I use castor oil on you? Nope. Oh, I know. Put the dress on the pig. Ah, damn it. <coughs> Face cat. I could try to use it for frying, but I don't really know what to cook. Okay. Put the ice in the blender? Ah. Shit. Oh, no. I put the brain, I put the brain in there. Right. But I can't. Can I pick it up with my hands? I mean, I, didn't they say I needed something to pick it up with, too? Do, 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 do. That's dread. The pig's dead brother, which is also dead. Okay, Mr. Body. I can't just carry it upstairs in my hands. There's got to be some way I can. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, uh, ice it. Ice, ice, baby. Right, take a closer look at the bot. Okay, yes. Ah! Look closer. Okay, now do it. Ugh. Okay, come on, buddy. We're going Come on, buddy. Slope. Okay. Up we go. Okay. 
Let's go give, let's go deliver you to the doctor. I need my brain. Oh shit, I went the wrong way. That's all right, I'll just uh, take the elevator here. <laughs> take the brain for a walk. Name it Bernie. Bernie's like, I don't know how to feel about that. Is that what I am? Just a brain. Big ball of cute. <laughs> it's Bernie. It's Bernie and the brain, 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 brain. <laughs> her head is like hanging out of the bed. I don't know why she does that. She's like, she'll put her head out, and then it's like hanging over the edge like that. Why do you do that, Bernie? That cannot be comfortable. All right, buddy. Here you are. Ah, I see you have it. Quick, uh, give it to me. Give it to me, boy. Okay. Is this what you wanted? One fresh human brain. What else could I want? Yes. Now we have a chance. Oh. Eradicate the bad, restore the good. Or what's left of it anyway. Uh, excuse me. I think... Is he trying to reanimate her or something? So maybe Agnes will end up showing up. But she wasn't dead in the original. The original one, she was just like... I don't really know what, who she was supposed to be. She seemed to be just like some random character. Shut up already and shut, shut up and do it already. I just planted a dead brain inside of her. Fingers crossed, Doc. Fingers crossed, Doc. This has nothing to do with luck, mind you. I am certain my calculations were correct. Now it's just a matter of following a correct procedure. But since my nurses took their leave all at once, I will require your assistance. This cavity here... Hold it open for me whilst I lower the brain into place. Hold it open for me. Fine. God dang it. Yeah, like it's put the first time I ever put a... Into it, boy. <laughs> That's better. That's like I ever held a, held a cavity open before. Hmm, maybe this way? <laughs> it's okay, it's just the bowl. We can clean it up later. That was my favorite Almost bowl. Almost got it. Just a tiny bit more. It's in! We've done it, boy! I see, and the dress will be for her then, too, alright? Does Zaya do drain, brain transplants? Nah, I'm sure you really are mad. I'm beginning to wish I'd never met you. I'm beginning to wish I'd never met you. You would have missed the only chance to save yourself and everyone else. Sure, this isn't the nicest job, but it's a job nevertheless, and it's got to be done. I... Look, we can talk about it later. Let's focus on our task. Now that everything is ready, it is time for the machine. The machine? Yes, we will need to kick some life into this young lady. She's still very much dead, have you forgotten? Forgotten, you're so full of shit. I haven't... I haven't really been listening. You're so full of crap. I haven't really been listening. Ha! Your mind is such a negative one. Your I eyes are Xavier really derpy, dude. Always how to handle the mind while I was best at handling the flesh. But he's not here. Tell you what, how about a peace offering? I let you do the honors, and soon enough you'll see for yourself who was right and who was wrong. Why is that a peace There's offering? There's a lever on the side of that chair over there. Can you see it? 